My father got me into sport. Um, he wanted um, to take me and my sister s sailing and he had a little dinghy boat. And then he thought maybe before we went sailing, we should go swimming. Yeah. Then he spent the next five years watching me and my sister sw swim up and down the swimming pool. And we didn't really do much sailing ever. So I'm in a swimming club called Out to Swim. I volunteer as a part of um, out for Sport, which is the umbrella organisation that looks after um, all the LGBT um, sports clubs in London. So I'm the co-chair of the, that umbrella organisation and we run um, training events and uh, social events. We, we try to um, work as a team um, all together. In 1994, I'd just joined the swimming club and I was just starting out, uh, starting back with my swimming. And we went to the gay games in New York. Around about then was like really the height of the um, AIDS crisis. In fact, a lot of my friends died for, from AIDS. In New York was possibly the absolute apex of um, the number of people who were sick and dying. So. Going at that time to New York was a really um, moving experience. I felt very proud of um, us being strong and powerful. One of the guys on our team, he broke a world record um, and he was actually um, HIV positive. The complete opposite of the image that was in so many people's minds about what it was to be gay at that time. And we brought that feeling back to London. Click the videos to watch more Londoners and don't forget to subscribe.